All right, welcome to this month's workout. Um, yes, I am sporting some new merch. I can't wait for you all to have it. I'm actually in love with this sports bra, um, but let's get to the workout because that's what we're here for. So today we've got a 15 minute AM wrap. Whoa, that is 9-11 um, themed because it is September. I do like to theme workouts after holidays. So this one's after 9-11. So we're gonna do 15 minute AM wrap of nine American kettlebell swings 11 push-ups, 20 double unders, and then one burpee step back to lunge each side. So let's talk through those. So hopefully you have a kettlebell. If you don't have a kettlebell, you can still use a dumbbell or anything heavy. You guys, I have used two yearbooks before and held those together. So whatever you gotta do to get some weight. So American kettlebell swing means we're going all the way up overhead. So I'll demonstrate from the front here first. And then here it is from the side. So a few important things to remember when you are doing a kettlebell swing is you wanna keep a nice engaged shoulders back, a straight line from your tailbone up to the top of your shoulders. This is a leg workout, this is not an arm workout. So you should not be straining yourself to get the kettlebell up. You should be using your hamstring and your glutes and your hips to push it through. So I'll really emphasize that here. So this is a leg workout. The momentum and a little bit of arm strength gets that up over your head. So you have nine of those. Then you have 11 push-ups, a few different modifications. You can start with the very basic into that plank, all the way down, all the way up. Need a little bit more modifying or maybe you have some lower back issues, you can go onto your knees all the way down, all the way up. As any coach would tell you, I would much rather you do on your knees with perfect form than on your toes with halfway crappy, lazy form. So doing on the knee push-ups is a great option. It's nothing to be ashamed of. Then we have 20 double unders. So hopefully you've got a jump rope at home. If you don't, I'll show you something else to do. Double under looks like this. getting underneath the rope under you twice. If you can't do double unders, you'll do singles. So one, 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 and you'll just double our quantity. So you would do 40 singles. And then if you don't have a jump rope, you can do these little bad boys, which is called a jump and double tap. So you'd go one, two, three, four, all the way up to 20. And then finally, we've got our one burpee step back lunge on each side. So we'll get down into that burpee, all the way up, and then you'll step back, back. So you only have to do one of those each round. So if um, you need to save yourself with the burpee a little bit, again, lower back issues or something going on, come into that plank, step up, and then you still got your lunge, lunge. All right, well, enjoy this month's workout. I'll see you guys again for next time.